everyone i hope you guys are having a fabulous day so far so today i'm coming at you with something that's very very exciting at least exciting for me it's my collection of the louis vuitton small leather good as known as slgs i did not even know the term slgs until about several months ago until i'm exposed to this luxury louis vuitton world but I've grown to love them and I've built the collection around them and I'm going to share this all with you but before we get to that, if you're new to my channel, welcome! My name is Amadea and I always hope that my videos can be helpful and useful for you guys one way or another I upload every single Friday at noon so don't forget to click that subscribe button so you don't miss any of my future videos and also um, check out my Instagram at heyamadea if you want to get to know me more and also if you want to enjoy the little things that I post check out by Amadea so I do have two Instagram accounts so without further ado let's get to the video uh, so I'm gonna share with you the SLGs without well I guess there is a particular order it's not from the least favorite to the most favorite it's just from the the very first item that I got which I think you all know if you watch my channel to the very the, the uh, I guess the most recent thing that I got so yes it starts take a guess my very first Louis Vuitton purchase which is an SLG, which is also a very wow experience. This is the Emily wallet. So uh, this is my very first Louis Vuitton piece. I bought it new, I bought it from the store. I bought it online first, but it was stolen. I still don't know what happened to it, but check out my video. I'm gonna link everything down below. So it was gone, but so I went to the store and I picked this up and I just love it so much and it's pretty much still look new because right now i don't really open my wallet that often because i always use my card holder which uh, the one that i'm currently using is not louis vuitton it is from the tory birch which is this sky uh, blue saffiano leather which is has that four credit card slots and one slot in the middle so i just use this a lot every time I need to pay something every time I need to show my ID I just take this out and that's that I never really have the need to reach out to my wallet unless maybe to take to get some cash with it which is very rare so that's why it's still in this almost new condition so the second thing that I got is also in the same combination monogram and this, this full shell lining which is this six ring key holder this one I got it pre-loved from eBay but when I got it it was pretty much still new and I had the receipt and everything and I just love this I never thought that I would need a key holder but turns out I did and this is it and I carpool every day with my husband so he was the one he's actually the one who's driving most of the time so he actually the one who holds on to this uh, more often than i do and if you see the button here it's kind of starting to uh, look uh, peeling at first i thought it's uh, it's kind of a bummer but after a while I thought it just tells a story and it just it just tells that the item is well well loved next thing that i got is this louis vuitton a multi-colored a zippy queen purse and it has this uh, light pink lining which is very very pretty I just love the combination and I just thought I at first I wanted to get a black one but the black one was always more expensive for some reason compared to the white one probably because with the white one you have to worry about color transfer or things like that to get dirty easier but I don't know I ended up getting with this and it's pretty much still feels like new even though it's not and every time it's still clean and everything and I have to admit that I haven't really used it that much unless I use it for the very first time about several weeks ago when I went to Las Vegas and I was bringing my crossbody um, favorite PM with me so I needed a small wallet so this is what I brought with me but again because I use my Tory Burch called holder to reach out for everything I never really had the chance to uh, get this out but it is still a very piece of art and I just love it so much and the next thing is 
Uh, again, if you watch my video, my very first Louis Vuitton handbag, which is the Neverfull MM, it comes with the with this pouch. I don't know what exactly it is called. I believe people call it Neverfull pouch. So it just comes like this. It's still very much new because I've never used it. I tried to put stuff in it, but I don't know. I just don't see myself reach out to this a lot, even though people have been raving about this, how you can use this at as a clutch or as a catch-all or everything it is it has a very slim profile but I've seen a lot of YouTube videos reviewing about this stuff and it does fit quite a lot but I just haven't reached out to this yet I just keep thinking when I'm traveling when I'm bringing my passport it will be perfect for it but I don't know I just haven't used it yet but I love the look of it it's just so slim so compact so streamlined and this is the Louis Vuitton um, key pouch. So if you, oh, it's just so small, like so. I don't know. It's just so teeny tiny. I just love it, love it so much. So if you compare it to the ring holder, it's just almost uh, the same, the same width, but serves a different purpose. So it has a zipper, like so. And here I just put my key fob, and and my house key and my office key. Here and it's empty, so you can you don't have to use it for uh, for keys. You can use it for coins or uh, hair ties or lipstick. It fits a lipstick, so and anything you want really. I just I just love how compact and small it is, and I feel like every single thing in my bag now has its own home. You know, like this key. Usually, I don't really think having a key having a key holder for my keys but it does now so everything has its own little home in my bag so I don't know it makes me happy just to think about it so the next thing is again another similar thing which is this uh, brown coin purse and I've been eyeing this for a very long time and I finally got it pre-loved and it's still in a very good condition and I right now I just use it for coins even though it might get dirty and I might need to remove the coins but I don't know for now I just I don't know I'm just happy to use it for coins and people have used it for um like not earplugs earphone why would we keep thinking about earplug anyway people use it for earphone and stuff like that and you can use it for anything you want and the next thing is this um Technically, this is an SLG. This is the pochette accessoires. What I have been using it is not as an SLG. I have using this as a handbag. And this strap, it doesn't come with the pochette accessoires. It comes with um, my um, favorite PM. But I just use it so I can use the this thing as a crossbody. And I just love the simplicity of it. Uh, even though it is small, but it's not small. But it just fits a lot and I just love it. I just can use my phone and wherever now I'm out and about, I can just throw in my phone, my uh, card holder, and then my key. And that's all that I need and it fits. And I just love the added look of the pom-pom and just makes it really, really cute. And you can also use it, of course, you can use it as an SLG. Um, if you want as a catch-all in your bag to bring your essentials and stuff like that and it does come with a uh, With a short strap, which uh, I'm gonna reach out <laughs> which it does come with this uh, short strap Which I don't really use because I don't really know what to use it for but yeah I just love this bag so much. The next two is the brand brand uh, addition to my collection. This is in the Mir Aben. So if you haven't noticed the rest of my collection has been in monogram so this is the only two which is in the mirror aband so this is the first one is again the key ring holder and six key ring holder the demir aband with the rose ballerine lining so i got this new my friend uh got this when she was in spain and i don't know i just love the combination the chocolate color and with the light pink the con the the contrast is just really really oh so beautiful and then the next thing is also very popular this is the mini pochette accessoire so if you compare the two with the pochette accessoire this is the size comparison so it's pretty much 
look the same it uh, has the same shape and everything but of course this is because it's a mini it's much smaller and I haven't used it yet but I can't wait to use it because look at the bright interior it's just so amazing so the very last thing that I got is um, it's not new it is I bought it pre-owned from eBay again eBay is always a good place but you just have to be careful so this is the uh, discontinued item this is the Trous 28 the toiletry bag basically people say they use it as a clutch but I don't see myself using this as a clutch because it's just too boxy it is a toiletry bag and I don't think I don't know you can use it for anything you want but I don't see myself using it as a clutch I see myself using it as a toiletry bag obviously or a makeup bag so this is a vintage uh, I don't know this is from the the year let me see 1984 oh no 1982 April 1982 so I don't know if you consider it an 80s vintage, vintage yet I don't know but it's still in the pristine condition all the inside has no peeling and it has no smell or whatever and the zipper works uh, very uh, properly and uh, it is kind of misshapen shapen a little bit but I don't mind it it just tells the story behind the bag it is vintage and it is old it has been I don't know where it has been but I did clean it up with a leather condition uh, conditioner and a leather wipe so it that's what makes the little canvas still look uh, shiny and pretty much like new so that's that that's my entire collection of the Louis Vuitton SLG some all other goods if you want me to create a separate video about any of the item I mentioned here let me know in the comment down below so I guess that's that don't forget to click subscribe so you don't miss any of my future videos and I'll see you guys in the next one bye bye